Hey fellas, thank you for joining me. Man, this is el chingon. <laughs> Hope you guys doing well. Sunday evening here. I need a shave, so you can see. Got a couple days growth. This is my last shave. I started to shave. God bless you all. Thank you for the support. Let's continue on with the uh, mail call from First Line Shave. And this will be with First Line Shave, Red Label. From Michael Riley, St. Louis, Missouri. Made in the USA, so you can see the American flag there. Awesome label. This is in the 3.0 base. I highly recommend it, guys. Make sure you go to his website and check it out. This set is available. I checked just before I uh, press play on the record button. And uh, it's available with the EDP as well, so highly recommend this soap here because it smells amazing it smells very masculine in my opinion it screams masculine <laughs> this is from a uh, inspiration homage to another uh, popular cologne and that is Christian Dior Fahrenheit this is medium strong scented soap the scent it's awesome brand new puck as you can see there version puck And again, label design from Chicano Designs, Rafa. Very talented artist, uh, artist, in my opinion. Keep doing a great job, Michael and Rafa. You guys are a great team, and I uh, appreciate you both very much. <laughs> Thank you. Sent notes for the soap bar. Like I was mentioning, in the FLS 3.0 base, four ounces of soap. Scent notes, top notes, bergamot, lemon, lavender, violet, hawthorn, honeysuckle, mace, chamomile. Heart notes, jasmine, lily of the valley, cedarwood, sandalwood. Base notes, notes amber, patchouli, leather, tonka, musk. Lentiscus, or lentisca, lentiscus, and styrax are the scent notes for uh, Red Label here. And I can tell you guys when I smell this. Oh, oh it smells great. I'm glad I also picked this one up. This one's a hit <laughs> with the scent, in my opinion. Another cologne type scent here. And you know me, guys, I love cologne tinted scents, and I'm glad I picked this up. Can't wait to lather this on the face. So let me press pause here, and let me get the lather on the uh, on my brush. Let me show you the brush, by the way. There's a very beautiful brush here that I'm going to show you guys, and it's brand new to the den. I just haven't uh, used it yet. But I'm going to use it right now, and... Hope you guys enjoy it and like it. This is my Merit 995 from Heritage Shaving, Her Heritage Collection Shaving, Neil, Neil Breed. He makes some awesome brushes, guys. Make sure you check out Heritage Collection Shaving. He just came out with a new uh, Ever Ready that looks awesome as well. And uh, he's coming with new, uh, he's bringing, he's coming out with more brushes. So stay tuned for that. Make sure you guys are uh, subscribed to him and are following him. He just let, he did a latest uh, pre-order for his newest uh, Ever Ready and it looks amazing. And this one looks amazing as well as you can see. This has a 26 millimeter fan knot. I believe it's this two band badger. But it's very gelling. <laughs> very jelly tips. You guys can see the clump up clump up gel tips there. Very soft knot. The knots from Neil, they feel very luxurious and very soft. Badger hair. I washed this already, but it always tends to lose a couple hairs during the process process of the wash. No big deal, as long as it doesn't lose a lot. Beautiful merit brush from Neil once again. 
newer merit to this collection. Make sure you're following Neil at Heritage Collection Shaving once again. No funk, so that's awesome. I'll be back with the lather. Stay tuned. All right, guys, I'm back. I uh, put the uh, the access lather on my face as a pre-shave. And I got my brush here loaded already, ready to go. Let's start the lather. First line shave, red label, 3.0 base. I can tell you guys when I was lathering the soap, the soap pops. When I put the water, hit the hit the uh, knot with water and start swirling it on the tub, the scent's beautiful. And I love that very much. It's very aromatic right now. This whole bathroom smells like a red label and it's awesome. It's a big knot here from uh, Neil at Heritage Collection Shaving. So make sure you roll pretty well because his knots are very dense. Very dense knots. This feels great in the face, like always. 3.0. It's top notch soap. Plenty of water in that brush there, so you can see it's just coming out when I press on the lap. So that's plenty of water. You can see it's dripping out of the knot. Beautiful, luxurious lather on the face. It smells beautiful, guys, this scent. I highly recommend this scent here. If you guys are into cologne type scents, this scent's very blended, very well. Michael did a great job blending this together. And I could tell you that this scent smells like a woody, woody fragrance. That's what I get. It's very complex, the scent. So I don't, go, I don't get every individual notes from the soap because Michael uh, blended it very, very, very well. But I do detect the woody, woodiness from the scent of the soap and it's amazing. I love it. Let me just add a couple droplets of water here to my knot. Scent strength on the soap. It's mid strong. So I would say it's about a seven. I got plenty of lather there on the face. So I'm just playing with the lather here. Feels amazing. Feels very, very nourishing, very luxurious feeling. Very hydrating soap. Beautiful brush there from uh, Neil at Heritage Collection Shaving. Gonna be using my non XLL Joseph and Sons Sheffield England razor here from uh, my brother Joseph from my uh, Edge Dynamics from the UK. <laughs> Thank you, brother, very much for this beautiful razor. This is a uh, 7 8 square point black uh, scales with. Gold, gold pins there, as you can see. Very sharp razor. But as I use it, it's very smooth. They start to uh, shave on the face with my razor with 3.0 red line on the face. Let's start to shave. As you can see that beautiful shininess from the soap. Very glossy, very shiny looking. It looks luxurious to me, in my opinion.
you can see. Great ladder. It's very well hydrated, the ladder here. So hold on, guys. Give me a second here because I don't want the uh, ladder. It's on my hands here. I don't want it to get on the pins or anything like that. Give me a second. Drying off the hands. This soap is mighty slick. Love it. The blade is cutting. The more I use this razor, I feel like it's more like more smoother as the time. The more time I use it, the more smoother it gets with every pass. Beautiful ladder. Scope here is like Elmer's glue. It's very thick. And it feels beautiful, like I was mentioning. mega slick like oil on glass when you uh, rub oil on glass and it's super slippery <laughs> that's how this base is I absolutely love and I'm a big fan of the soap here see the residual awesome residual that line of lather You can see, look at that, that line of that right there. And you can see that it's cutting the razor there. That's hair. Just wanted to show you guys real quick. Awesome. Gotta go in the work tomorrow, so on Monday's start of my week, so I have to, I don't have to, but I wanted to get cleaned up and Shaved up for tomorrow, so I don't have to do it in the morning. Wow, my face is soft. I just can't stop top just touching myself. It's so soft. Let me dry my hands here. If you guys are still with me, thank you. Pass two with my brush, let's start the ladder.
telling you this, these knots here are super dense. Might have to revisit the puck here and swirl it a couple of times. Beautiful, beautiful set. Beautiful woodiness. that I get from it. It's hot in here. Once again, the beautiful glossiness, shininess from the soap. It's awesome. Hope you guys are picking that up on camera. Pass two against the grain with my razor here. Pimple went over it. It's not bad though. Very soft, very nourishing, very hydrating. Like I was experimenting last time when I, I was using the soap here and the Star Odyssey scent. That's what I'm feeling now. So it's the same base. Very nourishing. With this soap here, you don't need aftershave, guys. You can go out without aftershave. It's that great, the soap. Beautiful scented soap. I'm loving the scent. Last time my girlfriend came home, she was telling me what was I wearing. Not that I was just finished shaving with uh, Star Odyssey. She was, is that a new one? I'm like, yeah, and she loved it. She told me that she wanted me to uh, use it again. <laughs> She kept smelling me and smell. She just couldn't stop smelling me. She loved it. I'm pretty sure she'll love this one too. You can see the razor is just sliding, sliding. This is so slick.
My hair is very coarse on my mustache area and on my chin area. Very coarse. Like bob wire. If you guys follow me, you guys know. Very using light, light pressure here on the mustache area. I need to go over that again. Didn't get as close as I wanted to right there, but the residual can do that. And get a final rinse here to see if I need any more uh, spots that I missed. Always right here, right here. Got plenty of soap. This scent's beautiful, guys. I can't express it so much. It's beautiful. I love it. Remember, the whole trifecta is available. That should do it there. Let's get a final rinse. Absolutely baby butt smooth. I love that. I love a very cold slight shave. <sighs> Took that two days growth right off. It feels awesome. <laughs> Great, Chingon. It's hot in here. It's very hot in here. Thank you for joining me, guys. I really appreciate you guys' support. This soap is awesome. Just truly epic, this soap scent here. I really love it. I enjoyed this shave very much as I was shaving through my whole, uh, uh, whole, the whole experience through the shave. I could smell the sand and it's just beautiful. <laughs> I mean that, guys. It's beautiful. That's why I'm smiling. Like, I'm, I can't keep from smiling. This scent's awesome, Michael. You did a great job with this scent here. And I truly commend you, my brother. Thank you, brother, for this scent here. It was a pleasure using this soap once again. Beautiful scent. Highly recommend it, guys. So make sure, if you guys are interested, to pick it up. Great job from Michael. And just to throw a little note there, uh, Michael has a charity backstoppers.org which he donates to uh, each tub sold from to the charity so make sure uh, that's awesome of Michael very awesome of Michael to do that because Michael is a uh, backstoppers is a, a you go on the website and it says there that you know that's it's for the fallen uh, first responders that you know die on the line of duty and Michael is a police officer, of course, and he donates to that organization, which is amazing, awesome of him to do that. I got one, I got one cut there from the weep, from the pimple there, so you can see it's a pimple. And I got a couple of weepers on the mustache area, but looks like they sealed up. 
my skin is feeling very nourished, very supple and soft. I can tell with this new soap base here that, you know, it's it's like you're putting some, you know, luxury. It is luxury, but like if, if you're really buying a luxury lotion and putting it on your skin, it just feels amazing. And it feels amazing and I don't need to put aftershave on. I feel my face feels great with it out without it, but I'm going to because I have it and why not, you know? Plus I want my girlfriend to smell me when she comes home. She's about to get home pretty soon. I took the uh great packaging from Michael. He packages he packages the aftershaves and the soap really, really nicely. He uh puts tape around the uh the cap here so no aftershave will spill out and the the cap here will stay intact and won't screw off. That's great. Beautiful color from the label, uh from the bottle here. I think in the past uh, Michael had like a uh clear. This is a red bottle here. <laughs> so you can see matches the label. Outstanding job from Michael. Thank you, brother, once again. This red label is fire. It's fire scent. Beautiful, beautiful scent. I love it. So I had to uh, use that brush to match this uh, this beautiful uh, after splash and soap. <sighs> new ingredients, guys. New ingredients for uh, Michael Riley's uh, new aftershaves. He updated his... Uh, his aftershaves too, and I can tell you, they're awesome. It's a pleasure using, using this aftershave here. Here we go. Oh, wow. That feels great. This is so awesome. I'm gonna apply a little bit more. <laughs> oh wow, beautiful, beautiful scent. Michael did an amazing job putting this scent together. Wow. Ah, yeah, I wish I could bathe myself in this stuff. This stuff is amazing. <laughs> Thank you guys, you guys are awesome. Thank you for the support, I really appreciate it very much. Today's shave was with Redline from First Line Shave. Beautiful soap from St. Louis, Missouri, Michael O'Reilly. You're awesome, brother. Keep doing the great job you're doing. Your soaps are amazing, brother. Your new base is killer. I can say and go on and on about your soap base, but you can see the smile on my face, and I love it, brother. Thank you very much. Thank you for this amazing soap base, and it's a winner in my book. It's top-notch. It's an elite soap. It's high. It's very high up there, very high up there, and thank you for making it. Thank you for uh, bringing it. And thank you for shipping it to me. It was a great buy and I love it. Thank you. Use my Mary brush from Neil at Heritage Collection Shaving. Make sure you check them out. Beautiful brushes. Beautiful knots as well. This knot feels luxurious when uh, lathering on the face. Feels like a pillow just exfoliating your face. Awesome. Beautiful gold, uh, beautiful gold uh, painting there. Beautiful. He asked me what color I wanted the merit, and I, and I mean the lettering merit, and I told him gold. So I think I, I thought it, I saw I saw it before in some other brush of his, another type of brush, the red and black, the black and red I mean, and the gold popped. So I decided I wanted the gold. So it pops. And use my uh, Joseph Allen's and Son Sheffield razor right here from England for my brother Joseph at Dynam Dynamic Edge. Great brother, thank you very much for this beautiful razor. It shaves awesome, very sharp. Thank you. And the aftershave to top it off. Beautiful label, beautiful color to the aftershave. Thank you, my brothers. God bless you all. I truly mean it, guys. God bless you and your families. Thank you for watching my channel. I really appreciate it. Have a great night. I hope you guys have a fantastic week. And uh, see you next time on Mendes. El Chingon Shaves. <laughs> love you guys, my brothers. Thank you very much. One love. Take care.